Hey guys, it's Fnat Guide, and today we are playing Realm of the Mad God Exalt yet again. Last time we upgraded our equipment yet again. And that's basically what happened there. I'm gonna go and claim that. And. Yeah, that's my character. In I go. Oh, tag. I forgot where I should go. It's in here. Right. I forget that every time. I have no idea why. Bag. Then one for storage. I have no idea what's in this one. Anyway, let's just hop back in. I imagine there are going to be a lot of people on here anyway. Nope. Let's just get into Lich or Lick. How do you pronounce that? Huh. There are only three people on here anyway. Four people actually. Maybe five. Okay. What, what was I thinking? Sass bag do I have no idea. Maybe I should put that in storage as well. Oh well. And of course, me doing but one of the easiest quests in the whole game. When I'm, at, when I'm literally at one of the highest levels. All I just need to upgrade is this, and then we'll be good. or what?
or out. Sober again, finally. So, you may have noticed this is the last episode of Rome of the Mad God I'll be making this year. So, maybe you, won't, you may be wondering if there are more coming. Yes, there are. And I'm certainly very glad to announce that. Even as Adobe Flash perishes, we all knew that was coming when HTML5 came on the scene. And because HTML5 can basically be used on both desktop and mobile, so, that basically was the final nail in the coffin for HTML5. That, not HTML5, Adobe Flash. But, now was, now is the time to finally uninstall Adobe Flash before hackers get in there and put malware on your computer. Because, you don't want your computer not functioning properly. So, you best uninstall Adobe Flash now before it's too late. Now, I'm not trying to use scare tactics to convince you, but it is a true story that people have sent out fake Adobe Flash updates and they end up installing malware on their computer. Literally. Anyway. Now as for what is happening next year, I hope to get my hands on Xbox Series X. I haven't been able to get one get my hands on so far this year, unsurprisingly. And actually, I just reached level 20, unsurprisingly, as well. So, as for the Xbox Series X, that won't be happening until sometime next year. As for PC content, I hope to do more Minecraft survival, and Maybe Halo Master Chief Collection. That seems pretty good. Because that would be basically the run up to Halo Infinite, which was supposed to launch alongside the Xbox Series consoles, but that didn't come along. And now, since Cyberpunk 2077 is not really doing well on the Xbox One or PS4, the calls to cancel Halo Infinite on the Xbox One have been growing louder ever since Cyberpunk 2077 launched. So, who knows? But I think, you know, my plans for Xbox Series X and potentially a PS5. You know, Matt Omatic. I ended up talking to him earlier today, the day I'm recording this, and as you may know if you watch his channel, he intends to make a Tomb Raider Legend Let's Play. And I asked him what platform, he said Xbox 360, and being that Tomb Raider Legend on Xbox 360, you can play on the Xbox One through backwards compatibility. I asked him if he plans to do it on the Xbox One, and he said no, just the Xbox 360. And that didn't really surprise me at all, given past history. And I, kind of, I suggested that because 
He hadn't really tried that before. And because Xbox One videos on his channel are pretty much just limited to Evolve. So, no wonder why I'm talking about that. Anyway. Maybe in the future I'll try again. But I may just get the same result. Oh well. Not getting any of those. Let's try with this. Instant. Tier 7 robe, there we go. I wanted a tier 8 staff, but... Oh well, what are you gonna do? Um...
Is he dead? Or is he just tripping me? Someone go on there. doing it. Again, I'm not doing it. This is all too familiar. Adventure is not over yet, unfortunately. We will come back. So, if you did enjoy this video, then please make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you next time.